Jab him. Crying emojis in the chat. Oh my lord, what is going on everybody? It's your boy Duty back again with another video. And that's right folks. It wouldn't be a Monday morning without a WWE Champions update. That's right, and our boy Phil was out wailing this weekend on WWE Champions. That's right, and what was he getting? Apparently our boy Phil was in some type of tournament or contest to try and acquire Jacob Fatu, the new bloodline required, whatever the hell that means. Uh, I do know a little bit about the bloodline stuff. Isn't that, have, that has something to do with um, the Samoan or, or the uh, Pacific Islander wrestlers? You know, like, who the hell knows, man? Your boy Duty doesn't watch wrestling. I haven't watched wrestling since, since Hulk Hogan and the Ultimate War was a thing. And if you're curious, my favorite wrestlers of all time were probably the Road Warriors. And I remember when they were actually the uh, the Blade Runners. When it was uh, Hawk, uh, Hawk, Animal, and Sting. And I believe the Ultimate Warrior. I think he was part of that, if I, if I don't remember. But anyway, enough of my WWE Champions uh, lore. Or excuse me, WWE lore. Uh, I go back that far. So I haven't watched wrestling since, but I, I do understand... The bloodline has to do with a whole bunch of Samoans or or whatever the hell. Big, big, fat, big, fat Islander people. There you go. Anyway, <laughs> it looks like a boy Phil was out whaling out this weekend. And on Saturday, uh, it looks like he spent $1,135. It seems to be that's the new go-to for Phil. He's spending about a thousand bucks. So I guess he's composing himself or he's not wailing out on every contest and spending two grand like he was previously. Uh, but he is doing it multiple times. And I believe this is the second week in a row where our boy Phil went out and spent over 1100 bucks. I think the last time was 1160 something. So uh, I guess he's learning how to finally um, manage his money. <laughs> I can't say manage his money without laughing. I, I guess he's he's uh, he's he's finding a way to parse out his discretionary spending. I, I guess that's the best way I can put it. Uh, but still, still wasting eleven hundred dollars on JPEGs on sweaty JPEGs, a mobile game, is ridiculous. I couldn't fathom spending eleven hundred dollars in my entire life on any mobile games. I mean, if you combine all the mobile games in the world, I couldn't picture my spell myself spending. Eleven hundred dollars. I just couldn't. I just can't. I just can't. Can't force myself. I don't care how interesting or fun Candy Crush is or Fallout Shelter. I don't give a shit. There is no way I'm dropping that kind of cash on a stupid ass mobile game. Something that you play when you're sitting on the toilet uh, and you're bored and you're there for a while. Not even that. Cause that's disgusting. Don't don't bring your phone in the toilet. I'm sorry. Just don't leave your phone out. Take, do your business, wash your hands, and then go outside and, and go back on your mobile phone. All right. So anyway, yeah. Um, so I digress. So it looks like Phil uh, was playing this weekend, and he managed to hit 18th place. So uh, come on, Phil. You got to do better than that. I mean, there, there, are a bunch of, there are a bunch of whale dents out here spending mad money on it. For example, it looks like, let's see, from this list, it looks like you were the only one in your faction that even ranked up there everyone else um didn't belong in your faction and uh let's see woken warriors looks like it had two dents in there uh that that wailed out so you either need to find a better faction or you need to up up your spending because you, you're gonna have to uh wail out for some of your other little uh idiots in your in your guild or in your clan that just don't have the disposable income you do phil so you need to step it up because 18th plate ain't cutting it. Uh, you know, not not if you want to get that first place trophy and uh, make yourself feel better. Okay, Phil? Uh, so yeah, I mean, what else is there? Let's see. Let's see. Let me go back. So let's look at this uh, Jacob uh, Fatu. Uh, or Fatu. I think it's Fatu. It's Fatu. I believe it is. Um, so yeah, I mean, I... Okay, I, I get... I, I, Dude, I, I'm so lost when it comes to this game. And it's not because I don't want to educate myself about the game. It's just because the game is so fucking stupid. It's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. It's just so dumb. And why would anyone, anyone get addicted to this shit? 
it's just maddening. It is. It makes your boy Duty's head hurt. It does. Because I try to put myself in people's shoes and try to understand, okay, you know, I understand that some people have addictions to alcohol or drugs or gambling or um, women. You know what I mean? I, I could kind of understand that. I'm not justifying it, but I can understand it. But I just can't understand mobile games. I don't. Of all the addictions that you can have, why the mobile game one? It's so fucking stupid. You know, at least with alcohol, you get a little buzz. It changes how you feel. You know, it, it probably drowns your problems out for a little while. And then, you know, you're, you're back to your normal shitty life. And then you drink again. And, and drugs, same thing. Uh, uh, women, I mean, come on now. At least with women, you get some kind of enjoyment. Uh, even if it's OnlyFans, I guess. But I just don't get the whole mobile game thing. I don't. I, I, I really don't. There's so much more in life that will give you excitement, acceleration, will give you that high that you look for. I mean, come on, brother. Just, it's, ugh. anyway. Okay. Uh, so let's go to the tally board, folks. All right, here we go. And this is Phil spending so far in 2024 for WW Champions. Uh oh, and by the way, I, I, I actually had a people a couple of people comment in my comments on my videos and said, Oh, why are you still tracking this? He admitted to it. He admitted that he was down from the rafters. Because he didn't fully admit it. He's still lying. He said that he sold the account, which is a lie. No one believes that he actually sold this account. Uh so he's still playing with it. So until he finally admits that he is still playing as down from the rafters. I'm going to keep tracking this and exposing him for the fucking fraud that he is. And expose, exposing how much money he's wasting on this game. He is because he's still lying to his viewers. He tells his viewers, oh yeah, I'm still playing WWE Champions, but I only play it every once in a while. And the only time I play it is when I'm on stream, but that's kind of a business expense, right? He's lying to you guys. Everyone dropping him uh, tips and support. Thinking that it's going to go to him paying his bills and going to get in a new dishwasher and all this other nonsense that he's talking about. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. You know where that money's going at? It's going into Scopely's pockets. And as you can see here, just like I said, on September 7th, our boy Phil wasted $1,168. Then this week, this weekend, he spent another $1,135 for a grand total, folks. Grand total. Grand total, folks. Hold on. Hold on. Grand total. $28,852. Now, I know it's a little dramatic there, but I wanted, I, I wanted people to visually see that. I wanted them to visually see the money this guy is throwing on mobile games. And the other thing, too, that I wanted to do is actually... Uh, I forgot to do this. So... Yeah, so it looks like he's wasting on average about twenty-five to twenty-seven hundred dollars a month on WW Champions. That's that's what Phil is wasting on this mobile game. And that's where he's at so far. I mean, we're only halfway in the month and he's already at uh twenty what, twenty twenty three hundred? All he needs is another three hundred to fall back in that range. And I guess, you know, give Phil a little bit of credit. He's actually cutting back how much he's spending on WW Champions. Because if we look at the other months, I mean, ugh, the other months were just fucking ridiculous. 5,453 back in May. Uh, 3,700 back in March. Uh, February it was 2,800. January was 4,400. And January was when he thought he was getting all that uh, memberships. But it turned out to be the Argentinian memberships. Remember that, folks? So he willed out thinking he was going to get all this money. And it turned out that, nope, no money for Phil. Yeah, just utter, not, I mean, ridiculousness. $28,852 on a fucking mobile game, dude. And well, what, we're in what, September? We still got October, November, December. We still have three and a half months to go in this year. So at this page, Phil's looking at potentially, potentially around thirty-five dollars to $38,000 on a fucking mobile game, brother. Let that sink in. Let that sink in. I mean, how many millions of Americans out there don't even make that? How many billions of citizens in this planet don't even make that kind of money? And he's f just 
wasting it on a fucking mobile game. Anyway, that's it, folks. That's all I really had to say. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace out.